Welcome to online learning. Today we shall learn about weather and climate. Dear students, you would have listened from your parents that today the weather is not good or it is very good or it is favorable for enjoying some spicy dishes and tea. An atmospheric thermometer is used to measure the temperature of the atmosphere. Hey, do you know the weather of a place changes every day and every hour? The condition of the weather in the morning may be different from that in the evening and tomorrow's weather may be different from today. Changes in weather conditions give rise to seasons. In India, we enjoy three seasons. Summer. Summer is the season of roasting heat. The temperature rises above 40 degrees centigrade in many parts of India, leading to drying out of water bodies and water scarcity. Winter. The cold weather season in India begins during mid-November. Temperature drops to a very low level and causes frost in different parts of India. Monsoon The monsoon brings heavy rainfall in different parts of India. It spells a new life to the animals and plants found in India. It fills the water bodies which were once dried due to the roasting heat in the summer. And in this way, the monsoon bring a new life for the people of India. Winter, the cold weather season in India, begins during mid-November. Temperature drops to a very low level and causes frost in different parts of India. Dear students, you would have seen people wearing different type of clothes, eating different type of food and living in different type of houses and also cultivating different type of crops in different seasons. Our lifestyles vary according to seasons. Our food, clothes, the house we live in and the crops that farmers grow are influenced by the seasons. Take for example, the food we enjoyed in summer are spicy cucumber, watermelon, muskmelon, lemon water and mango. So what does really weather mean? Weather. Weather is defined as the condition of air temperature air pressure, wind humidity, and rainfall in the atmosphere at a given place and time. Farmers grow soybean, sunflower, cucumber, and watermelon during the summer season in India. When it comes to the clothes that we wear in the month of summer, it's different from that of the other seasons. Like we wear cotton clothes and loose clothes in the summer. We do wear these clothes 
to keep ourselves cool and sweatless. Next comes the monsoon. Monsoon is famous for its heavy rainfall all over India. So what are the crops which are cultivated during the monsoon? Groundnut, paddy, maize and pulses like moong and some other type of pulses are also cultivated during the monsoon. This is groundnut and this is paddy. We use some different type of clothes during the monsoon as it is the season of rainfall that's why when we move outside we use raincoat and gum boots these are some raincoat you can see the kids like you have over their raincoat and this is a pair of gum boot which we use when we move outside during the rainy season in India. Roasted spiced corn, ginger tea with biscuit and some spicy dishes are favorites of many people during the monsoon. Next comes the season of winter, the season of freezing cold. So what are the foods do we enjoy in the winter? What are the crops do the farmer create in the winter? And what are the clothes do you wear during the winter? Let us crops and vegetable like cauliflower, cabbage, carrot, potato, mustard, radish and wheat are grown during the winter season. You can see this is mustard, potato, cabbage, here we have cauliflower, carrot and some other types of vegetables are there. What type of clothes are these? Yes, these are the warm clothes. These are made up of wool and these are called as woolen clothes. We wear these clothes during the winter to keep us warm. These are some special dishes which are made and served during the winter. This is carrot pudding, this is potato and cauliflower curry, this is spiced okra or you can say spiced lady finger, this is spinach paneer and this is spinach Paratha and these are some different type of other type of winter dishes. Climate. The weather conditions that prevail over a large area and for a long period of time is called climate. The climate of a place remains the same year after year. Take for example, in India every year from the month of July to September we experience monsoon and it happens every year during the same time. Next in the month of October to Feb we have winter season is there and after that from April to May we experience summer season. And you should know that we experience these three seasons in the fixed time 
of the year we never experience rainy season in the month of december or winter season in the month of may or summer season during january or feb but during the fixed time we experience we enjoyed these seasons and these are called as climate of a place the same type of condition prevail here in india for a long period of time different parts of the world have different types of climate on the basis of the prevailing climatic condition the world can be divided into seven climatic regions so what are these seven climatic regions these seven climatic regions are very hot and dry next one is very cold very hot and wet warm and wet hot and wet cool and dry and mediterranean these are seven climatic regions of the world here is a map showing the earth current climate zones we have eight current climate zones are there so what are these eight climate zones first one is polar second one is sub arctic then cool temperate highland warm temperature dry tropical and major of welling zones you can see the red lines arrow with red lines and you can see the arrow with blue lines the red lines indicate the warm ocean current whereas the blue lines indicate the cold ocean currents now today's your homework will be define climate what are the seasons enjoyed in india define weather and how many major climatic regions are there in the world i hope you enjoyed the class in our next class we will be learning about the factors those influence the climatic condition of a place thank you